What's up you guys? Welcome to Vlogmas Day 16 and oh my gosh, I'm having such a good day. Okay, so I got my hair braided as you can see because I have 4C hair and it's short so my hair is always um, a little bit more to manage. So yeah, I got it braided. I'll probably be wearing wigs for most of the winter because since my hair is short, if I wear my real hair, I wear it wet a lot. So I don't want to do that because I don't want to get sick. So I just have my braids and the lady did like a really, really great job and she was really cool. So Vlogmas is going pretty good. Vlogmas, for those of you guys who don't know what Vlogmas is, I know, you know, you guys are like, what's Vlogmas? Vlogmas is just when you post a video every day in December so that's what I'm doing and also I'm just talking about beauty I'm talking about hair fitness lifestyle like travel and other things a part of my life and a big thing a part of my life that has been a part of my life for a very long time is school and I'm talking about college so um, I graduated high school in 2010 and I really you know, like I really encourage seniors and anybody, like before you go to school, really know what you want to do because like if you don't know what you want to do, then that makes the process a lot longer. So I am back in school this semester and I'm pretty much ready to finish. I am almost done, so I'm ready to finish and it's really <laughs> exciting. I don't know why I'm so much more excited this time because I think I just know what I want to do. A lot of the time your friends and your family and society will give you advice on what you would do, but you should just listen to yourself because I guarantee you that your friend didn't ask you for no advice when they was picking their major in college. So people always think that, you know, if you haven't figured out what you wanted to do, that their advice is needed when, thank you, but no, thank you, your advice is not needed. Um, and as I've gotten older, I've really learned who to take advice from about things like this, like professors and professionals and people in the field in which I want to be in, which is business. So and you can't take business advice from everybody. I hope you guys know that. Um, and business is all different. There's different fields and everything like that. So that's what I'm in school for. I do have a really good friend who's also in school for business and we go to the same school. And um, she's somebody really cool to talk to because you know when you're in the same field, you um, can have the same great conversations about things like that. So I'm really excited for school this time around. Um, this is the first time I'll be in school living on my own, like paying my own rent, like no parents, no family around me or anything like that. When I was in school in the past, I think that my family and my home life really did distract me a lot because it definitely, I definitely wasn't like super, super pampered growing up. So, you know, um, it was a distraction. And then when I was in younger kids school, like elementary school, I just was also distracted. My mom worked a lot. She was a single mom. So now I am um, living on my own, telling myself what to do, paying my own bills and taking it upon myself to go to school. Not my parents, not my friends not society i'm not asking anybody for any advice except if i want advice from you um yeah so i'm basically just taking it upon myself and you know i really didn't want to make this video because i don't like talking about personal stuff a lot but i do think it's very important because i do know people in my age like in your mid-20s and you're around that age or at any point in your life where you think about um Am I too old to go to school? I forgot everything. I don't have time. Is it expensive and all this kind of stuff? You can make as many excuses as you want to make. But the thing is, if you don't get back in there and finish school, then you will only be prolonging the process. So yeah, this is going to be a big part of my life this year. I do have a full schedule this semester, so it will be a big part of my life. Um, I'm gonna have to be a lot more serious, which I don't have a problem with. I am a lot happier that I am not living at home anymore because, to be honest, like, you guys know, like I know, that when you're 24 years old, you don't want to be dealing with 
your mama okay so yeah i think that makes it a whole lot easier on me i don't have nobody telling me what time to get up i don't have nobody asking me wasn't she supposed to be at class are you like you know so a whole lot less stressful so i'm a whole lot happier to be going back to school and i'm very excited this time i feel like i just want to get it over with so i like that feeling <laughs> um so that's what I've been doing. If I haven't been vlogging a lot outside the house, showing you guys what I've been doing or something like that, I've probably been handling some business like that, doing like tax stuff, um, school money stuff, registration, just going, getting a lot of stuff done. I've been running a lot of errands. If you live in Atlanta, you know how I know that the um, traffic is really, really horrible. So it's hard for me to like be in traffic and be vlogging. I mean, it's not hard. I could do it, but you know, I don't do it because I'm always like on a straight narrow path when I'm handling business. Because when I'm outside the house, it's like boop, boop, boop. Traffic is going to be thick. So get that stuff done, girl. Because once you get out, get it all done. Because when I come back home, I don't really want to leave. If I leave, it, I'm going to have to take a lift or something like that. So, yeah, I'm really excited. And I did want to talk about that with you guys because school is a big part of my life. I'm deciding to go back on my own accord. It's not my parents. It's not my friends. Um, like, it's not, I'm not asking for anyone's advice on, you know, I don't know. Like, I'm just very sure about what I want. Um, unless you guys have something that you think would be like. You know cool to say I don't mind hearing your comments um but yeah so I'm really really excited I'm really really excited this time I'm trying to cut down on a lot of things as the new year approaches like I've been throwing away clothes every day <laughs> like you guys should see what I'm wearing <laughs> like I'm wearing a cocktail dress in the house because So, um, yeah, I'm trying to cut down on a lot of things. I rearranged a little bit, just, you know, try, trying to freshen up for the new year. So, yeah, that's that. So, I am very excited. And thank you guys for watching Vlogmas Day 16. I may come at you with another video. How long is this video? This video is eight minutes. So, my computer was got broken the other day. And the day it got broken, I filmed this video about butt acne, and I'm still going to upload it because, you know what, some people, they need to know about butt acne. So thank you guys for watching Vlogmas Day 16. Make sure you leave a comment below and also subscribe because I will be making videos every day in December. You already know this. Every day in December. Vlogmas. <laughs> okay, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.